Absolutely. I would say that, frankly, I would be the first to admit, if you were strictly a technician and just looked at market prices, you'd have to conclude we're in a bear market. I am not a technician. I'm a fundamentalist. So in my 50 years of doing this, what do I look at? I look at the economy. I look at inflation. I look at monetary policy. I look at valuation. I look at bonds versus stocks. And everything comes up, you know, uh, saying it's a great buying opportunity. And that's what we've been hearing from mainstream media. Uh, the stock market's getting crushed again. And there's lots of signs of weakness. And uh, there's still a lot of optimism. If you're watching the mainstream media, they still believe in the long term outlook and growth of the market. Um, what's interesting is, like I said, as cryptos have been getting crushed, stocks have been getting crushed as well. And it looks like there's a lot of uh, correlation in both markets. But once we are in a full recession and if interest rates start to get higher and higher and higher, uh, I do believe that cryptos will start to outperform uh, and especially at you know what prices they're trading at today, they will outperform the stocks um, at least short term. But it's also very important to pay attention to precious metals like gold and silver and oil. Um, but for the most part, this is a very uh, unpredictable market. And uh, for the most part, I recommend everyone be cautious and cash can be your best friend. Uh, if you are looking to dollar cost average into this, you want to make sure you're making smaller buys so that you have money left over to continue to buy, whether it's a dip or a rebound. Uh, let me know your thoughts on this, and I will talk to you soon.